I fought in the American Revolution disguised as a man so I could fight for my country. But before we get to that, you should get to know me, please. My name is Deborah Sampson, and I was born on December 17th, 1760 in Clinton, Massachusetts. My dad abandoned the family when I was just five years old. Then I had to live with my relatives until, well, when they couldn't afford to kill for me anyway, and I was pleased to become an indentured servant to the Thomas family in Middle Bayville, Massachusetts. Once I could buy my freedom, I separated myself by teaching and leaving. On May 23, 1782, I disguised myself as a man named Robert Shatler and enlisted in the, in the Continental Army under the 5th Massachusetts Regiment. Once when I was on the battlefield, I was severely injured and a doctor realized I was a woman. I was fortunate enough that the doctor didn't tell anyone. I was able to save 18 months in the army until I was honorably discharged from the service. After the war, I went to Sharon, Massachusetts and married a fool and had three kids and one and adopted one maid. I was the first woman to tell and tell my story, the American heroine, while I waited for my petition to be back pay for my service to be approved in 1805. Approved and in 1805 I was placed I was placed on the pension list for disabled veterans. I will pass I think I will pass away on April 29th, 1827. And I want my headstone to lead the female soldier.